of war and wisdom. Does it please you, I wonder, to watch your city on the verge of battle? Yere. I might have a job for you. If you're as good a fighter as I've heard. You've heard of me? Don't let it go to your head. I hear about everything that happens in this city, Mystios. With flattery like that, how could I possibly turn you down? I'm not trying to flatter you. I'm trying to hire you. I need some Spartan military targets removed. I think you may have the wrong idea about me. General, uh... Demosthenes. I'm not a murderer, if that's what you expected. I expected you were someone who wants to get paid. Was I wrong? No, not completely. Fine. What do you want? My spies tell me the Spartans are mobilizing. What I want you to do is hamstring them. Get into their forts and remove the commanders in charge. I guess that makes sense. I'm thrilled you approve. You'll need to bring me the sailors of the commanders you kill as proof. You'll be amply rewarded. Those don't seem like standard Athenian tactics. They're not. But it will work, and that's what matters. We've already lost too many Athenians to those savages using traditional warfare. The other generals disagree, but I refuse to let them destroy our chances. What do they want to do? They want honorable face-to-face -face warfare, pitting our forces directly against the Spartans. We're not going to win a contest of strength against those brutes. We need to outthink them. So, will you kill the commanders? All right, I'll take the job. Good. I might not have approval to deploy our men to do this, but I'm not about to let that stop me. What's so special about these seals? Only elite Spartan commanders carry these seals, those in charge of entire forts. They'd all die before parting with them. So bring me the seals as proof that they're dead. Where can I find them? The Spartans have been making inroads into Athenian territory, taking over forts that once belonged to us. Make them pay for every inch. What's your strategy? Whatever it takes to protect Athenian lives and kill Spartans. That's not what I meant. What's your personal strategy? My career is none of your business. Know that I don't seek much. Only proper recognition of my strategic brilliance. You've told me enough. I'll get your seals for you, General. Do you have my seals yet? Yes. I have the seals for you. This will show those idiots in the assembly. We're making progress. Interested in getting rid of more polemochoses for me? I'm interested. I'm impressed with your work. Did you expect any less? I had hoped, but hiring you was a gamble. Most things in life are. I am perhaps a bit more willing to gamble than my fellow generals would like. If you take no risks, you win no wars. Exactly. How is it a mercenary understands this when the greatest generals of Athens don't? I'm not sure whether I should feel flattered or insulted. The Spartans are trying to find our supply lines. We've caught several spies already. We cannot afford such a loss. Not if you want to keep your troops alive, no. I need you to kill more of their commanders. Leave their hoblites without leadership. They'll be scrambling. Are you sure? Spartans are fierce warriors. Warriors, yes. Thinkers, no. They react like wild animals. Put them in a situation that requires genuine thought, and they fall apart. Kill the commanders and bring me their seals. We'll see how the other generals react to that. I'll get you your seals. The sooner the better. What do you think of the Spartans? If you were to ask General Ney on that, he'd tell you they were mindless brutes. That's half true. They have a base sort of cunning. It shouldn't be enough to withstand Athenian might. Assuming the other generals make intelligent decisions instead of stalling. You do know I'm of Spartan birth. You're more skilled than the average Spartan. In time, you might even manage Athenian citizenship. The true pinnacle of success. Of course. I wish I had more say over our naval forces. What I could do to the Spartans then. Have you held this command for long? I've been a general in the army for a long time. 
I made some mistakes in my early days, but I more than made up for them after. Still, everyone attributes my victories to luck, never to my own decisions. I see how that could be frustrating. Other men take credit for my victories. Cautious men who cause needless deaths by overlooking opportunities. You know what happens to a general who loses his reputation? Who gets blamed for the loss of Athenian lives? Nothing good. He dies. So I will do everything to preserve Athenian lives. Maybe one day, I'll even get credit for my accomplishments. Why do you need these seals? I need those seals to shove in the faces of the assembled generals to get them to wake up. While they've been debating and stalling, I've been winning the war. I know what I have to do. Goddess of war and wisdom. Does it? Do you have the seals for me? I do. More seals and more proof what we're doing is working. Thankfully, there are at least some people in power willing to listen to me. I'll leave the politics to you. As it should be. And I have more work for you, assuming you're up for it. I'm always interested in more work. I was worried about employing a mercenary, but you've been a pleasant surprise. Yes, that's what they all call me. A pleasant surprise. I suspect if they call you anything offensive, they don't live long. I couldn't say. At least I have you working with me, instead of getting in my way. Other generals giving you trouble. <sighs> they refuse to acknowledge I know what I'm doing. But it doesn't matter. I'll get the job done, and eventually all of Athens will know it. Are you ready for more work? I'll get you your seals. Thank you. First, I have some questions. Who does a general like you look up to? You know who was a true hero? I'm guessing you're about to tell me. Odysseus. He used his wits to triumph. Wily Odysseus, they call him. Without him, the Trojan War would have been lost. And the other generals understood that. What do you think your future holds? Victory or death. You don't stay a general for long if you don't win battles. I suppose many generals die on the field. Not the majority. The Athenian people are the greatest threat to a general's life. If you displease them, they'll remove you from office, ostracize you, or even condemn you to death. And you want this job? There is no greater purpose than the glory of Athens. It's my duty and my honor. Why is it I always find you here? Athena is the goddess of wisdom and war. What better place for a general to ask for blessings? You don't seem very devout to me. I'm not the first general in my family. My father was as well, and his father before him. You would have learned military thinking from a young age. Exactly. My grandfather brought me here when I was a child. He stood me here and told me Athena was our patron. That we must always offer her our respect on the eve of war. He sounds like a wise man. He was. He died in battle the next day. You come here to remember him. And to remember that though the gods may be our patrons, they will not always protect us. I know enough. Do you have my seals yet? Why, yes, I do. Good. The Spartans will soon realize someone is picking off their senior commanders. Probably, but they haven't caught me yet. Interested in more work? Of course. What do you need? At this rate, the Spartans will need to recruit from their farmers. You're really not fond of Sparta. Would you be, were you me? They challenge all that Athens stands for. They care nothing for art or education, or philosophy. For them, warfare is the only goal. Strange thing to hear from a general in the Athenian army. 
I serve Athens with arms because I am skilled with fighting and strategy. But I protect those who serve our culture and legacy. They're lucky to have you. I've earned my place. Would you be interested in more work removing Spartan commanders? I'll get you your seals. Why do you think the Spartans are attacking Athens now? Why do they do anything? For conquest, for glory. Because they know no other life than war. What will you do with all these seals? For now, I'll use them as proof of what I've achieved. It will give my words weight. Very few Athenians have ever seen a Spartan seal. But you have plans for them later. Someday, I want my children to see them. Then they'll witness me donate them to a temple. That should inspire them to earn their own. You seem thoughtful. Thinking of what happened to your grandfather? No. Thinking of the first battle I lost. What happened? I overestimated my own abilities. We were supposed to lay siege to a city, but I was impatient. I felt the need to prove myself at the expense of my men. You abandoned the siege? Yes. I led an attack my men weren't prepared for on Etolia. It was pure hubris on my part, and my men paid for it. My closest friend died in the battle. Never again. I see why you're so determined to get the Spartans at a disadvantage. They are already at a disadvantage. They made an enemy of me. I know enough to keep going. Goddess of war and wisdom. Do you have my seals? I do. The Spartans must be aware of your actions by now. They can't be happy. Interested in upsetting them some more? I might. What would you like me to do? You've impressed me, Mystheus. For a Spartan? Yes, as you say. It seems our fleet is under attack, and I need to redirect the troops to help. I will ask you to take on the Spartan command again. The commanders will be taken care of. You seem to admire art and philosophy. But how can someone who truly values that go to war? If you have any care for knowledge or the arts, you must be ready to defend these rights. I am here to take up arms so that they can continue to enrich our culture. As long as they are threatened, the battle must be fought. You expect total obedience from your soldiers, I suppose. So why do you fight for democracy? What is free will? It's essential that citizens play an active role in the function of their state. But Athens recognizes only select citizens. Spartans recognize merit. In Sparta, a slave can rise. Spartan rule would mean the demise of democracy. I'll leave now. Goddess of war and wisdom. Does it? Do you have the seals for me? Perhaps Athena was smiling down upon Athens when she sent you to me. You far surpassed my expectations. I always aim to do a good job. You have. <laughs> Beyond that, you've shown an understanding of war and its price. That's a lesson some never learn. This General Lysandros, you know him? What Spartan doesn't? If he's as good as he seems, then I'm even more grateful for your help. I respect his reputation, if not the man. War changes the rules for us all. So it does. Thank you, Eagle Bearer. I'm sure we meet again.